Ever since 1970, when the people of Azad Kashmir were granted the right to vote on the basis of adult franchise, the cabinet in Muzaffarabad has been a mirror image of the ruling clique in Islamabad. History has repeated itself again in the 2011 elections. The ruling Pakistan People's Party and other major parties have succeeded in duping the people of Azad Kashmir once again. The June 26 polls held across Azad Kashmir and in cities like Islamabad, Rawalpindi and Lahore were marred by widespread rigging and violence. It left at least three persons dead. PPP emerged the winner by securing 20 of the 41 seats. The opposition PMLN was in second position with nine seats and the Muslim conference was third with five seats. However, there were widespread allegations against the chief election commissioner for holding the worst ever polls. In a petition filed in the High Court at capital Muzaffarabad, former Pakistan Prime Minister Nawaz Sharif's Pakistan Muslim League PMLN has asked for scrapping of the results. Pakistan Muslim League noon AJK High Court may इन इंतखाबात को कलदम करार देने के हवाले से क्योंकि इसकी बुनियाद ही गलत है और वोटर लिस्टें जाली थीं या दुरुस्त नहीं थीं या नामुकम्मल थीं या उनकी तस्सी नहीं की गई थी। Money, muscle, guns and the support of the establishment played an important role in the outcome of Azad Kashmir elections. The ruling Pakistan People's Party (PPP) pumped in millions of dollars from the National Exchequer in the name of Benazir Income Support Program to buy votes in the election. I have a question that this sham election and then the law of the jungle is going to be able to give a message to the people. In the state of Azad Kashmir, there is no freedom, 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 no freedom. The region, now known as Azad Kashmir, was invaded by Pakistani troops in 1947. It is a part of the erstwhile princely state of Jammu and Kashmir. To prove that it is a self-governing state, Pakistan holds elections every five years. But the real power West in the Kashmir Council, chaired by the Pakistani Prime Minister. The people of Azad Kashmir do vote but fail to elect their representatives who represent them and can address issues that concern them.